Bonjour, ni hao! Welcome back to the Game Boys channel. I'm Johnny. And I'm Tim. And today we're here with the Bibbidi, Bibbidi Unboxing. Unboxing. So if you guys are long-term subscribers, you probably know what Bibbidi is. We've been doing them for over two years now. And if you're new, they are a Disney subscription service that you could do monthly. They have many other themes. Yes, uh, they have themes and products not just related to Disney, but also to many other fandoms, including, but not limited to, Harry Potter, Marvel, Nickelodeon, MTV, anime. Yeah, um, and you could kind yes. of mix boxes, too. They do have a preference sheet that you can kind of put all the fandoms you're interested in. If you only want a Disney box, they do have options to just do a Star Wars only box, Harry Potter only. Um, so yeah, we'll, we'll link their website down below. It will have more information, but the preferences is a huge win for us because there are a lot of movies we just don't want, don't collect. So you're able to put that in there. And if you have any special requests, you could also put that in there. And they're pretty good at doing that because like, I'll kind of just add stuff to my preferences and then like, a couple months after, I was like, oh yeah, I think I requested that. They got it for us. <laughs> yes, and the th interesting thing is that, like, as Disney releases more content, our things that we love are expanding. <laughs> so Tim had the pleasure, I have not seen it yet, of seeing Lightyear. Comment below if you have seen Lightyear. No spoilers, and let us know what you think, because like I said, I still haven't seen it. But That's like, cute. now there's room in our life for socks. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, I have... I have all Disney cats on my preferences, and then like in parentheses, except for Cheshire. But like, yeah, socks would fit in, but I might have to name him specifically. Right. But then things fall off our preferences. So like something that I think we were just talking about the other day is that like we're not collecting as much stuff from like The Lion King anymore. Or like other mm -hmm. films that like we love and enjoy watching, but we don't necessarily need to collect. So that's a really great thing that I love about subscription boxes is that as we, since as Tim says we've been doing this for a few years, mm -hmm. like as we grow and like develop into our collections, like the box is growing and like with us. So it's super mm -hmm. exciting. So this is the beautiful Bibbidi box and I love this neutral gray color. We, Tim and I, uh, love uh, using these for storage. Tim and I also watched, I think a couple weeks since ago, that show on Netflix about organizing the home edit. Uh, and so like I am uh, super geez. into putting... I don't know <laughs> what I was thinking putting that on because like I kind of like did it first because like on TikTok like I see all those like restock videos so like I was like ew our like laundry under the kitchen like sink needs some work so like I bought this like home edit thing and did it John's like oh that's super cute and like it went, he didn't really care so it's like okay cool and then I was like actually they do have a show I want to watch it so I turned it on one day and then this one <laughs> Oh my god, like a kid in a candy store trying to look at all their websites, going through all our cabinets to see like where he could put what and organize them. So yeah. See, so if, like, if you've been watching for all, you know Tim loves to shop, so it's bit, when I start like just online shopping and buying a bunch of stuff, Tim knows it's for real. <laughs> but it looks really nice. We got one for our laundry room and... Our pantry. If you want us to do a video on that, let us know, because I mean... Mine as well. I love the whole minute. I it has made it has brought like zen and peace <laughs> to my mind, which as representing Wanda, you can slightly know that that is, can be fractured sometimes. Yeah. But back to <laughs> Yes, I got distracted. Back <laughs> to the Disney box. So this we do get different levels sent to us for review. We are brand reps for this company. So if you want to save on your first box, you could use coupon code GAMEBOYS and that will get you 10% off your first order and give you a free sparkle pack, which is stickers and magnets, mm -hmm. which is a super awesome deal. It works on any level box, so they have reasonable boxes starting subscription ones starting at 40 going all the way up to 300 and then they have like other ones like a pins only box and uh like we said the sticker box which they 
includes. So this month we have a fantasy box, which we haven't opened in like a really long time. So it's going to be interesting um, to see what they did because there is two of us, so I'm sure it's harder to curate a smaller box like this for us because, you know, we like our stuff. <laughs> So we're gonna just open up. So when you open it, ooh, you pink. have yeah the pink. Make it pink. And then they do include a packing. Oh, that's cute. They made their castle like brighter. I thought it was. Sometimes they give like confetti things oh, that yeah. stab you. But um, this is your packing list. Will tell you all of the prices for your items. And then when you open the pink pretty tissue paper, okay, I already see a red box. So we're gonna save that to last. So let me just dig in the confetti, and I'm gonna grab this. Oh. Okay. So um, they do also have a wish list, which they update every month to let you know their new inventory they have in. You could heart it, letting them know you want it or something similar, so they can kind of go off of that if you don't put a lot in your preferences. So I did add this to mine. Oh, I love it. I I didn't add these to mine. Oh, you don't add anything. I it's add stuff me. sometimes. <laughs> oh, this is so cute. Mm -hmm. And it's perfect because Tim and I are filming this on June 25th, which means tomorrow is 626 day. So here is a beautiful uh, pin collection of four stitch pins, so they're all glittery. These are beautiful. They're stitched in his rocket ship, and I love the glitter. There is, I don't know, I I will show this to Tim and ask who that is. There is Lilo, and then there's Scrump. I think Scrump's driving the red car, or blue car is my favorite. This reminds me of when we used to go on like rides and you'd pick the car you want. This, there's someone in that, like it's like a gray like head. I thought it was like the woman head of the Federation no, or whatever. That's like, I don't know. I don't know what that is. Uh, I know, it kind of looks like it's like one of those like alien gremlin things, but then like when you look it kind of looks like it's just the car and that could be like the controller. Oh, it could be like the a, like a chair thing yeah. with a Let guy. us know down below if you know what that is, but yeah, I love the other three. That one, I don't know, but I love that. If you had to pick a ride vehicle to ride in, which one would you pick? Yellow, blue, or red? I want the... Yellow one. I'd probably p pick the red one. Or, yeah. Yay! Great first item, and we love pins. Yeah, we're obsessed with pins. Okay. Okay, so this is something you put on your way. I see, I didn't you tell me I never <laughs> add things. <laughs> and then after I was like, you selected that? Because, like, we bought these ourselves. We haven't opened them yet. But that's... What if we... When we open True. them, like, we don't get what we want? It could be a very good one that we might not get. But this is a Loungefly Mystery Pin Box. And this is from one of our favorite movies, Hercules. And you have all the muses. And then the chase is... Hercules as a statue, which I want. So, um, a fun thing is, this is our June box, if we didn't say, but July is my birthday month, so next month is gonna be my birthday box. Yes, yeah, so if you're not a subscriber and you want to be notified of that video, be sure to hit that subscribe button. Yeah, and since next month's gonna be my birthday month, I'll let you open this. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, sweetheart. So nice. I don't know which one it is, too. Oh no! Oh no, I don't. Uh, <laughs> I thought I, it was a statue. I don't know their names, but I want all of them because. I think that's like Cleo or. Okay, also, I am like obsessed with like Greek mythology and like Greek aesthetic, and like I would love to make that into a Luke. That's a, that's a toot. It's so yeah, pretty. Yeah, so this is cool. This is the first one we have since we haven't opened those yet. So, awesome. All right, so I'm gonna do the gym shore since I let him do the pins, but I think there's one more thing in here. Oh, oh, this is a cute sticker. It is from one of our favorite movies, Up, and look, there's Russell. He is in a wilderness and he is just trying to help you. He is stuck underneath the stairs. So exciting, we have the gym shore, which you know is the red box. And it is our, one of our favorite things to collect. We do have many in our background. And um, this one, I think, 
based on the size, it might be one I selected on my wish list, which will be exciting. And they put the spoiler on the side, so like, don't look at that if you want to be surprised. Okay, nice. And then I always dump it because it's easier that way. I'm trying to think what you what I was on the wish list that you would have selected that that's shaped. It's not shape. one that you would ever have selected. I wanted it because it helps us complete one of the series. Oh wait, I think I know what this is then, based on the size. I just don't know who. Ooh. Yay, it is the one I thought. Oh, that's so oh, pretty. Yay. So these are called the personality poses, and it's all the princess sitting. And we have so like these came out years ago. There's a new series that just came out with them sitting again with like, <laughs> a friend. No, with um, icons. Oh, well, that's right. She's with the shoe. Rapunzel's with like the lantern. But this series we didn't have Cinderella, and based on Amazon, like I think we're complete now with this series. Besides the Rapunzel one, which is hard to get, and then later on they released an Anna sitting one and Elsa and like those are super hard to get but um out yeah. of the OG original yeah, sit out what, of the sit what's so them. funny when you say like there that there were a series because we have all of these and I love or not all of them but well, the ones that Tim mentioned yeah. and I always just love that like their personalities are just sitting <laughs> <laughs> yeah I don't get why they're called personalities right I never got that but this is perfect because like her base is skinnier so it will fit where our shelf is I'm gonna insert a picture of all the other ones we have, so she'll look perfect next to these. So this is Cinderella. She looks all proper and pretty with her dress. And then the base is just kind of a little bit basic. They could have oh. put like, sometimes they put really cool things on here, like the background of a castle or something. This is called Be Charming. No. Oh. And she has her choker. I love this one. This is super pretty. You know what's funny when Tim talks about like Jim Shores and like the new releases is that they remind me of Funko. Cause remember they did like the princesses, but then they decided to do the princesses with stuff. And now they're doing the princesses with stuff in glitter. <laughs> so it's interesting like the release like patterns, well, right? They get better each time though. These, I wish they had a year on them, but I want to say these are like at least five years old. They're series. beautiful. Oh, but yeah, it's nice because it's light and these aren't super expensive. So like if you want to start out with Jim Shore collection, like these are the ones to go. And I like that there's like, they're narrower as you were saying, because like, and it's also interesting. So we have one, it's like the Tiana one, her base is kind of like, wider so like she doesn't fit on her shelf as well but like so we might end up having to like move those somewhere else but it's fine like... good box Tim. Yeah. see and we look we both put stuff on the wish list I mean, that is true alert. all right packing slip uh curated love uh with love by becky thank you so much thank becky, you, becky. And in this fantasy monthly subscription box, there is a uh, Cinderella Be Charming for $32. The Loungefly Lilo and Stitch Space Adventure four-piece pin set was $25. The Disney Hercules Muses blind box pins were $10 each. And the three-inch custom decal Pixar Up Russell decal uh, was $2.50, bringing the total value of our box to $69.50, which is a great value mm -hmm. for this box because Tim and I don't have very good shipping. Yeah, so this box is $59, so that's a nice value. So yeah, again, if you want to get one of these boxes for yourself, use coupon code GAMEBOYS at checkout. I would say my favorite item is this Gym Shore because it's one that's been on our lot list for a while. I was going to say the Muses pin just because of all the aforementioned reason, reasons, but I'm going to end up going with Cinderella only because I feel whole now that our um, collection is complete for the... the personality well, poses. Well, as complete as it is. Yeah. You know what I mean? But so 
Yeah, you'll have to let us know what your favorite item is down below. And if you like this video, give us a thumbs up. Yes, and if you enjoy Disney game, pop culture, and lifestyle related content, and you're not a subscriber, be sure to hit that subscribe button to be notified of our future videos. And if you are a subscriber, thank you so much for joining us today. And we can't wait to see you in our next video. Take care and be well. Bye. Bye.